hello friends welcome to wp suggestion in this video we're going to see that how can we create a animated gradient text color effect in our elementor website you can see here is a heading and here is a subheading and all the text are animating with gradient color effect and we will going to achieve this effect with 100 percent free method let's start the video if you are new in this channel please hit the subscribe button and press the bell icon for upcoming video notification okay this is a blank page and we are going to create a single section and I am going to set the height as fit to screen and add a background color for the better visibility. So I use the background to black and now I am going to add a heading text. You can also use the text editor element as well but in this video I am using the heading element. So let's add the text align the text to mid center i am going to stylize the text so i am change the typography and make the size bigger is the way to bold okay now i am duplicate this text this will be our subheading and add the subheading text here and also change some font style and change the size okay that's okay now we are going to add the animated gradient effect in this text color with the help of a simple CSS code snippet. If you are using Elementor Pro, you have an option to add custom CSS code in the custom CSS area of the advanced tab. If you are using Elementor free version, don't worry, you have multiple options to add custom CSS code. First option, go to your theme customization section and here you find the additional CSS field you can easily add your custom CSS code in this field and also you can use third party plugin like custom CSS and JS or you can use Elementor HTML widget to add your custom CSS code. In this video, I am going to use Elementor HTML widget to add custom CSS. Now, where do you find the CSS code? Here I am going to provide a link of code pen in my description. Here is the CSS code. So we have to customize a little bit for our design. In this code, you find a HTML section. We are skip this and we just copy to dot header classes to last and go to the HTML widget. So when you are going to add custom CSS code in HTML widget, keep in mind you have to add a style tag for that. So style and tag will be automatically closed. Now we are going to paste our code here you can see that dot header is a css class for this code so we have to add our css class we can uh, keep this dot header css class or we can change to our custom class so i am going to add a css class for our first heading so i am going to add one section of this element and here the css class area heading one so I am adding heading one CSS class for this element and copy the class name. Then again, click on this HTML element content and change the CSS class to our recently assigned CSS class. Okay. Now you can find that the color of the text is animating. But in this code, the font family, font size, font weight, and data spacing, because we already stylize our heading with the Elementor stylize option. So we can easily delete this code. Okay. Now you can find that here is the linear gradient color option. You can add your own hex code for this animation. So the best way, go to htmlcolorcodes.com and choose your own color known hex code for your animation like here i am copy this hex code of the color and simply replace it by pasting the color code and also choose the second gradient color copy and we can replace it okay we also uh, change the direction of the gradient here if we change it 60 degrees the style of the gradient will be changed and we also control the speed of this animation by changing this value of this hue. Here is uh, set as 10 seconds, but if we want, we can change it for 2 seconds, 1 second, or even in millisecond. If you need more speed for this animation, you can 
change this to millisecond like 500 millisecond or 0 0.5 second you can see here the speed of the animation is going so fast so you can adjust this animation as per your need and for the next heading next subheading we can just copy and paste the code and change some value uh, for it uh, like we can copy from here copy from heading one class to end of this code and just hit some enter paste the code and we have to assign a different css class for our subheading so we are going to the advanced section of this text element and here we add a different css class like heading to copy this class again go to the html widget and here we are change our css class to heading 2 now we can find that this subheading also animated and we can change the color and speed as well so here we change the speed and also the gradient angle now you find that the text color of these two different heading element animated differently and beautifully if you are planning to add this css code to your theme additional css uh, area you must keep it in mind you don't use the style tag for that because this area is specially allotted for the css so if you are thinking to add this css code just copy the code entirely and put it without the style tag so i am going to remove the style tag here and from the bottom here and i am publish this code and just read this section delete and update it i am refreshing the page okay okay now you can see that the animation is also working very well okay you can find this code pen link and the html color picker link in this video description hope this video helpful to you for your creative design if you like this video please hit the like button and if you are new in this channel please hit the subscribe button and press the bell icon for upcoming video notification thank you